Hey everybody, ShellfireXG here, and today we are on episode 18, I was about to say 17, I don't know why, 18 of our Pokemon Sun Let's Play. In the last episode, we took on Olivia, and we won our second Grand Trial, so now we need to head to the Aether Foundation, which I'm pretty sure we have to go all the way back over here. So, let us use our Charizard to fly us over there. But I hope you guys are enjoying this series so far, and I'm sorry that the uploads are kind of like really separated. It's just... I, I need to figure out how my uploading is weird. I don't know why. But let's heal... Oh wait, I think she healed up our mons, but just in case, let's heal them. Alright, there we go. And let's buy a few more super potions. Here, just to make a 25. All right, there we go. Um, let's buy another hyper potion to have a total of eight. Revives, those are really expensive. I would like to have eight, but that's okay. I'm just gonna go. And there's an Aether Foundation member. Then I've... Sure. I don't know what that was all about. Okay. Anyway. That means... Oh, I see that shiny over there. See that shining. A Zygar cube. Oh, I can't go this way. No! Alright, so... That means, I thought that was a shortcut to get there, but I guess not, so let's just, um, where is it? That's not it, that's not it, oh, it tells us where it is, but I can't fly there, I can't fly there, but I can fly here to get over there, yeah, anyway, <laughs> let's do this, yeah! Thanks, Charizard. You're the best. Now let's use Tauros. Right, there could be Zycard cubes around here, so before I go in there... What a beautiful beach! The way his hairstyle looks, it's from another video game. Do you guys know that? The guy that looks like, um... You probably don't know what I'm talking about. Like, you know, like, the in here but you know like the um oh i know what it is hello i find this guy pretty interesting as well at the beginning i was like eh about it but i'm just gonna run because i don't really need to fight him is there an item over here Wow, seems pretty climactic to... Alright, anyway. But, uh... It's like Phoenix something, because it... It was a guy that was a lawyer from 
from afar, the hair does look sort of like his, but maybe not. Yo. So let's go in here. Man, this is a beautiful place. Sorry, I was just checking. Uh, do -do. Oh, you know what? This from afar, the the things that are on the side of the bulb, it looks like something out of like the um, Legend of Zelda franchise. Oh, there he is! Hello. So you came at last. And I'm sorry, also, I'm sorry for the last episode that I had to be a little bit quieter. And I looked over the audio a little bit. I didn't really sound all that loud, but at least you guys could have heard me. But, sorry about that. Ah, but forgive me. I haven't yet to introduce myself. My name. I may call, you may call me Faba. Faba? <laughs> I told you before that I should show you some place a toning right well that wondrous place is the Aether Paradise. Let me tell you about Aether Paradise. Just as the name suggests, Aether Paradise is a variable pa paradise for Pokemon that floats far out in the sea, surrounded Alola. It is an artificial island made entirely by human technology for the protecting of Pokemon. Of course, I'm an adult who keeps his promises. So, I will prove to you that all I've told you is the absolute truth with a tour of Aether Paradise. W you will come, won't you? Yes. Good, good. Then, you'll come with me. Aether Paradise will amaze you. Wait, me too! Oh, even? Kahuna Olivia has come to see you off. As a Kahuna, I look forward all the trial goers who come to my island. They're like my own children. Not that I've got any. I've never even gotten married. Listen up, you two. Your greatest opponent is always yourself. Your greatest allies, the Pokemon beside you. Thanks! She doesn't even look at her. Are you coming too, Professor? I've got my own business to attend to. You go see all the amazing tech and tech that Aether is developing and tell me about it later. Yeah. That's right. I'll see you on the next island. Alolita- I can't even say these islands! Island, yeah. Then let's meet up at Meli Garden. Yep, it's goodbye. Akali Island. Though I guess we can come back anytime we want to, huh? Then let us enjoy an adventure upon the grand vessel that will make will take us across the high seas. By which I mean to say the fairy? Fairy, I meant fairy. Can you believe a big hunk of iron? like aether paradise can float in the sea and it's all because of the pokemon holding it up did you know that shadow i knew that really i knew knew i could count on you to react 
Oh, wow, you're a jerk! Oh, I can't wait to actually see inside Aether Paradise for myself. I'm gonna kick your ass! <laughs> I just love how we have no expression, it's like... Mm-hmm. <laughs> Way! So far, we- Aether Paradise! Oh my god! What? What the heck was that? What was that? What did I just do? What was that noise? What is wrong with me? Sans! I just blame everything on Sans the Cubo. Hypno. That looks like- that Hypno looks like a friend of mine. But I don't know. Who does he look like? Let me know down in the comments if you think he looks like somebody. Anyway, here we are, you two. This is an Aether Paradise. What? What? <laughs> Aether Paradise is a factually create. Officially created for the conservation of Pokemon. It has been outfitted with all of the latest technology for this purpose. Downstairs, our teams work on developing new Pokeballs and more. Yes, all for the sake of Pokemon conservation. Though, you will not be able to use any of your Pokeballs within Aether Paradise. A jamming signal is broadcasted throughout the... ...fensely to prevent them from functioning. Wait a minute! So I can't send out my Pokemon! Why can't I send out my... I guess I... I don't know if they mean the Pokemon that I have, the Pokeballs that I use, or do they mean the Pokeballs that I catch other Pokemon with? I don't know! But anyway. Excuse me, Mr. Fabe. Yes, excuse you! What is the meaning of the, that form of address? I have a title for a reason! Wow, he's a jerk. How else will anyone know how important I am? Yes. Branch Manager Fabe. Now I must go speak with the president about the our conservation efforts on Aki. Akale. Or whatever. Show these children around and take it. And then... And then take them to meet the prince. My people need me. Hiya. Phew. Welcome to the Aether Paradise, Shadow and Hugh. My name is Wiki. Wait, should I say Alola or nice to meet you? I'm gonna go with Alola. Yeah! Oh, wait. Wait! Wait! You know who we are? How do you know that? One of our employees told me about your meeting of on Akali Island. Now, of course, I heard how you helped protect the Pokemon there, too, young Mr. Mr. Hugh. Thank you very much. Let me show you around. The main entrance is up above, yes. Uh, us. 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 I, I, I need to speak. Shall we zip right up there? Wait! I don't even show any facial expression. I just see Q going like this, and then I'm just going like this. 
This is so much fun. I'm <laughs> this is the main entrance. You can have your Pokemon taken care of at the reception desk there if you if they need it. Okay, so it is just you can't catch any Pokemon. We can use we can send out our own Pokemon, but we yeah, and it is 15 minutes. Wow. Oh my God! It's oh, that's not Choo Choo. That's not Choo Choo. That's not Choo Choo. That's just a Pikachu. Shadow. Wait, Shadow. She's not even staring at me. You and Hugh are both trial goers, aren't you? Are you hoping to become champions? I suppose you must be around 11 then. Wow, that's the first time they ever mentioned that because in Pokemon Red and Blue, they mentioned how Red is actually 11, not 10 like in like in the anime with Ash. And if any of you say that Red and Ash are the same person, I will slap you across the face. Anyway, I like how they mention that. I like how they mention in the games it's 11 and in the anime it's 10. I feel like in the anime they should have said 11. Hmm. 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 Do you think that? Do you think they should have? Maybe? Maybe? I don't know. I'm gonna go, yeah, I am. Yeah, I told that first chance I had to join in the island challenge once I turned 11. Because someday I really want to be able to beat my Gramps, but he's way too strong. Oh, yeah, because he said he's the first, um, Grand Trial. And as we all know, the Grand trial captains don't use their full strength when um Hugh's grandfather said he, he has a lot of different Pokemon he had a Tauros also which we use to ride around Alola anyway how how lovely for you she paused there why that's a pretty strange pa are, are you okay I suppose all children must yearn to take a journey to their own choosing when they can when they get to be around your age. Though you're hardly just children anymore, trainers are like parents to their Pokemon. Shadow Hugh, would you two like to see the conservation area upstairs? You know what I just realized? I actually, I want to correct, dang it! I want to correct this lady. I am not 11. You know what? Whatever, I don't care. I don't want to correct her. I'm much older than that. I'm much older than that, but because I, I am practically an adult now. Yep, I am practically, so I can, I can say, never mind. <laughs> what am I saying? I don't even know anymore. Let's just continue. I, 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 I don't know. I, I, yes, we're 11 in this game. Ah! Hey, the paradise is a safe haven for the, all the Pokemon. For the reason the use of Pokeballs is strictly forbidden within the area. I, I don't even care anymore. I, I just need to stop. Wow. We keep Pokemon that have been targeted by Team Skull here. And we also try to s support Pokemon that need a little extra protection. Like Corsola, for example. They are quite terribly overhunted by a Pokemon known called Toxapex. Wow! Dropping some knowledge! I hope you don't mind if I read a passage from my Pokedex. Toxapex. Toxapex crawls along the ocean floor on its 12 legs. It leaves a trail of Corsola bits scattered in its wake. 
Yeah, my Gramps is always saying that nature's got its cruel side. Sure, as it gives us blessings. But can the Aether Foundation really protect all the Pokemon there that are out there? Nature does have its own balance, of course. It can be difficult to judge just how much we humans should try to affect that. Can it? That's pretty amazing. The Aether Foundation seems awesome. But why'd you bother setting up a branch in a place like Alola? I couldn't say. It's hard to know for sure what our president is thinking sometimes. If you'd like to meet President Lusamine, she should be here in the conservation area now. Okay, I don't get this with my reading. Whenever I read a certain, like, passage, in my head I'm fine, but when I'm reading out loud, it's like, everything is, like, good. I don't know what it is, and now I'm ibidab everything that I know. I just start to slow down. I don't know why. But anyway. Can't go that way. Hmm. That seems like a pretty good exit. But let's, what about this way? Can't go that way! Where am I go- Where am I going? Where am I- Okay, that brings me in a circle. I can't even- What the- I can't even see the guys- Oh, he's wearing a mask! Like, from the side, I couldn't even tell what the heck he was wearing. Um... I'm guessing this brings me all the way back down here. Yeah, it does. Do I have to talk to her? Yeah, so I have to look. So I guess I have to go up here because I looked all the way over there. And turns out they're blocking that way. So I guess I have to go over here. Let's see. That's one big circle. Always explore everything, people. Everything. Did I? Yes, I found her. Hello. My sweet Pokemon, I promise I'll keep you safe. I'll protect you with my love. Hmm? Ah! You must be Shadow and Hugh. Welcome to the Aether Paradise. The Aether Foundation's own private island. I am the president of the Foundation, but please, just call me Lusamine. I am so glad that we got to meet you. I'm glad that there are people like you who travel the islands to learn more about Pokemon. But there are also those unfortunate people who harm Pokemon for their own selfish reasons, or even for profit. And that is why I am here. I will be like a mother to all of those poor Pokemon and shower them with love. She sounds like Papy Papyrus. And shower them with- Yeah! It is I, the great Papyrus! I will shower my friends with love and- Wait, I will shower my friends with- Hugs and kisses! I don't know. It sounds like it to me. Even Pokemon from distant worlds far from the Lola region are worthy of my love. Wow, Miss Lusamine. I don't know how you do it. Do all this. You're like not even that much older than us. Oh, you sweet boy. I'm already over thir- I mean, 40. Okay, um... I just wanna say, I... In like, um... 
during the time span of Sun and Moon. I knew about this part because a lot of people said what Lusamine's age was. And out of everybody, we're all saying the same thing. She does not look 40! Over 40! I don't know! I don't know how! She must have, like, the fountain of youth or something, because... How? I don't know! 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 Maybe it's just... Maybe it's just... Animation at its finest. I don't know. <laughs> you are? She's serious, like... Wait, what?! Oh, you. The right style does wonders, you know. And you, your style is a bit wanting, hmm? I'd have to take you out sometime and help you pick a smashing elf- WHAT?! 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 Okay, I'm not gonna- ah, Meh! No! 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 Time out! Time out! Nope! Okay, like what you wear? I don't think anyone else could pull off that kind of look, except maybe Lily. No! Hugh! You started to mention her name! Oh no! This is bad. Oh god! No! No no no! No no no! Oh that's not good. They just she just went serious. Oh god. Oh don't you worry. You just leave everything up to me. Trust me, child, we'd all be much happier if I'd only listen to the adults around them. What's happening? What's happening? That term... Termor... Did something happen on the lower floor? You know what? That's her voice. Did something happen on the lower floor? <laughs> no! It's up here! Look at how happy Lusa Lusamine is. She was like... Yo, it's Ultra BC01. Ultra BC01. Did you come? From another world? Really? Miss Lusamine, stay back! That thing's. not right! You poor creature. Yo, I don't know what you guys are doing, but I'm gonna do the average thing in every movie and just walk up to it. Yo. Oh, it's gonna battle me? Oh, no! <laughs> Jesus! I was not prepared for this! Um... Leech life. Okay. Hopefully... Venoshock. Okay, that's not gonna affect me as much. Okay, that doesn't affect me at all. Um, okay. Bubble beam. Oh, okay, so it's, uh... Okay, so we... Now we know water... Wait, why don't I just go for my Z-move, then? Here, I'll use a super potion just in case, because I don't want to...
I don't want my, um, I don't want Charlotte getting destroyed. Man, look at Charlotte. She's putting in the work. I thought this Alter Beast was going to be trouble, but I guess not. But let's go! For the Hyrule Vortex! Yeah, Hydro Vortex. Because I believe we were not able to capture that. Sans grew to level 28. I mean, 6, not 28. That would be very bad if it was level 28. gone the unidentified creature disappeared so it's true I still need that Pokemon I need to get it back what miss Lucimine did you say something Oh! I can tell that she's evil now! Look at that grin! Look at that! That grin! That grin! I wish I could just go back and just show it! That grin! That is so disturbed! Oh my god! That is a mastermind evil grin if I ever seen it! That creature we just saw was undoubtedly a an ultra beast. If unknown being from another dimension that suddenly appeared from the ultra wormhole it looked like it was surfacing like it pained it to be in this strange place i can't bear to see that happen i will save it and i will love it what anyway <laughs> I'm just okay. I'm done with losing me. Thank you, both of you. Thank you so much. I don't believe that for once. I don't believe. No. Nah. -uh. Mm mm. Mm mm. I don't like that. I don't like losing me. I don't know. No. I. I knew it. As soon as I first met her, I knew something off was gonna happen. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. Winky. These two are still in the middle of their island challenge, aren't they? Please deliver them to the to their next island. Oh, at once. Oh, at once, madam. I will go to check that now. Wait, none of our poor recent recent Pokémon came to any harm. And I need to speak with Mr. Fabia about extra exactly what happened downstairs and of course I will have to start preparing the foundation for our newest and perhaps greatest duty yet the project of the Ultra Beasts I'll see, I'll see the two of you to Aluli Island, then. As soon as we go down, she's gonna... Yeah, as soon as we go down. Nope, they didn't. Nope, nope, no. Nope. Okay. I thought they were gonna... Okay. I never thought I'd actually get to see the ultra wormhole in my life. You've got to tell Professor Burnett about this the next time we see her. I don't know if what happened should be rightly described as an ancient, but I think it's probably best if you do so. 
Anyway, I was very glad to get to meet you both. Please, take this to remember our visit. Some... Men... Men of the dice for Hugh. Yes! Big... Oh, I think that's the name of the... Okay, awesome! Isn't it crazy how tastes even better when you eat them together with something else? Yes, I think I know what you mean. Meals always taste better when you share them with the ones you love. And for you, Shadow, a TM... For the Moose... Yes! Psychic! That will help when... Our Pikachu evolves, but sadly, we don't have the Thunderstone yet. Oh, well! Anyway! Well, I hope you both have wondrous adventures on your island challenge. Goodbye! We will! Thanks, Miss... Wiki. And Shadow and Hugh traveled to the next island. Wow, this is actually- Wow, this is cool! My heart's still kind of racing, you know? The Alter Wormhole is really the Alter Beasts are really too. Too big. I actually like how we have reactions now. I bet we'll discover more even in the next island too. We're gonna need all the energy we can get time to dig in. Hey, you wanna... Oh, he's sharing. Oh, thanks, you! Oh, it's so good! Whole thing. Oh! <laughs> Yay, we made it to the third island. Oh my god! It's Pelper! 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 Yo. Land a ho! Alright. Terra Furman Underfoot Again, what? 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 Eula Eula Island is like another total different place than Mele Mele or Ake Akale Huh? I've got an idea, Shadow. Let's have a battle. Sure. I want my Pokemon to get a, a deep breath of this fresh new air. Don't worry, I'll make sure both our teams are in fighting form first. Okay. <laughs> Just mimic you every time. Oh, he has three Pokemon while we have five. Well, it's sort of bad for him. Why does he have an Alolan Raichu? I want to know this! Why does he have an Alolan Raichu? Oh wait, why'd I go for Bug Bite? That shouldn't do much. Oh, that does a lot. Bug Bite. Oh my god! Yo! I should live. I lived. Leech Life! I should've went for Leech Life first. I wanted to go for Leech Life, but I look at Bug Bite and I just go like a... Yo, Hugh, can you give me a Thunderstone? That would be perfect. Choo Choo Guru to level 30. Flareon. All right, let's give someone else a chance because, hmm. We haven't seen 
You know what? We've seen Sans a lot. Who haven't we seen battle? You know what? Let's go with Spirit. We haven't seen Spirit in a while. Yo, Spirit! Time to unleash your full power! That's pretty cool how he has a Flareon. That's like an interesting... Oh! He must have got that EV2! From the hatched egg! I see you. Anyway. Why does that do so much? Um... I just gotta hope, will he miss it? Can you miss? Can you miss? Is he gonna do the same amount of damage? Yeah, it is. Okay, so I'm gonna have to switch. Aw, oh, that's so sad, too! I feel bad for Spirit! Come on! <laughs> Why did you do so much damage? Stop this! Die! Just go, no! Go, go, away. Go, go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Spirit grew to level 28. Shark grew to level 28. Ramen Hood grew to level 32. All right, now let's this. You know what? It's sort of funny. I'm actually happy that you- I know, like, your rival usually chooses the weakness towards you, but I actually like how he has the water type because these are my two favorite starters out of the Alolan, um, region. So, let us begin. I am Robin Hood. Do you hear my name? I am Robin Hood. Stare at me! I am Robin Hood! I take from the rich and give to the poor! <laughs> what is the matter with me? I feel like I'm just. Okay. Bwah! Bwah! That battle took my breath away. I can't breathe the fresh air that way. We're supposed to meet up with the professor, right? Where was it? Mealy Garden? Why'd he want us to go to a garden? Guess we'll find out when we get there, huh? I mean, right? The run on Pokedex! Oh my god, the run on Pokedex! Can I... Wait, wait, wait. Run him! Stop talking! Okay, thank you. Alright, so I think we're gonna end off the episode there as usual. We always... Why do I always end off in a Pokemon Center? It would either be in front of a Pokemon Center or... In a Pokemon Center. I don't know why. I guess it's just a habit with me. Anyway... Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Make sure to leave a like and comment. And as always, Shadow Family, make sure to stay creative. I'll see you guys next time. Later!